King of the Mountain. Welcome back to King of the Mountain Tournament number two. It's time for the final group of round one. We've got four drivers and two spots left in round two of the tournament. Who's gonna take them? Driving today, we have Dom Drift King Willie driving in the number 20 Dom's Tuner Shop. The LJ Sisters driving in Gold Fire Tsunami 2. Handy Rob Frontier in the Yakuza. And last and certainly least. Hey, come on. The windshieldless van. Uh, uh, are you sure about that? I guess I stand corrected. He has a windshield now. Yeah, Susan didn't like it either, so she made him go to the salvage yard and pick up a windshield. Well, good job to Susan. And I guess I can stop picking on Obi-Wan driving in Von Solo. Is that an X-Wing on top of the van as well? Well, you said the van had no Star Wars references, so... Okay, but did Obi-Wan Kenobi or Han Solo ever fly in oh, X-Wing? come on, come on, don't start that. It's a valid question. Dom Woodley out in the lead, followed by Handy Rob Frontier. The Millennium Falcon might have been a better choice. Dom holding on to the lead into the last corner. I give him a solid B for effort. And here they come to the finish line. It's going to be Dom Drift King Jr. picking up the first win, followed by Handy Rob Frontier, the LJ Sisters, and in last place, Obi-Wan. Although I feel like Obi-Wan must have flown an X-Wing at some point. Bro, in bro, his... we're trying to race cars oh, here. Sorry. Here we go with race two. We have the LJ Sisters on the front right and Obi-Wan on the front left. Let's see if that windshield helps Obi-Wan or hurts him. The LJ Sisters off to an early lead, followed by Dom Drift King Jr. Woodley. Obi-Wan lagging behind. LJ Sisters approaching the second turn. They are clean in and out. Dom Woodley having some trouble back there. LJ Sisters rounding the final corner and they will pick up their first win of the night with a track time of 17.602 seconds. Whoa. A little fender bender there between Handy Rob Frontier and the LJ sisters. And we're missing somebody down here at the finish line, and it is Obi-Wan. I'm sure he's glad he installed that windshield now. Yeah, definitely. Let's take a look at the replay and see what happened. You can see Handy Rob got sideways there a little bit, pushing Obi-Wan up high on the turn, causing Obi-Wan to come crashing down. And then we have the LJ sisters completely ignoring the traffic sign. Hopefully they didn't cause any damage. Here we go with the start of race three. We have Obi-Wan starting off on the front right and Handy Rob Frontier on the front left. Dom Woodley, your current leader with eight points, followed by the LJ sisters with seven points. Handy Rob in third with five points and Obi-Wan only has one point. Ah, I see what you did there. Obi-Wan surprisingly in the lead. Handy Rob Frontier having some trouble there. He gets sideways. Obi-Wan all by himself. This could be his chance. He's rounding the final corner and Obi-Wan will pick up the win. Wow. Obi Wan gets a track time of 19.2 seconds. He's followed by Handy Rob Frontier. Ooh, Handy Rob gives him a little bump there. I don't think he liked losing to that van. The LJ sisters are over on their side with Dom Woodley stuck behind them. A surprising race there. Let's look at the replay. Obi-Wan and Handy Rob are close. Handy Rob pulls to the right. You can see the LJ sisters also pulling right in front of Dom Woodley. That causes them to wreck. Handy Rob losing control coming out of that corner and that left Obi-Wan all by himself to take the win. Here we go with the final race. Dom Woodley and Handy Rob Frontier in the front row and those are your two leaders. They are tied with eight points. The LJ sisters behind them with seven points and Obi-Wan with six. Dom Woodley with a strong lead here followed by the LJ sisters. The LJ sisters pushing, trying to pass. Whoa, Dom loses control. And down goes the LJ sisters. We still got Dom Woodley and Handy Rob Frontier, and Dom Woodley will take the win. And he's followed by Handy Rob Frontier. That means those two will be advancing on to the next round. Looks like somehow the LJ Scissors got back on their wheels. They're stuck over on turn three with Obi-Wan. Here's another look at that crazy race. Dom Drift King Jr. Woodley almost getting spun around. He gets hit by the LJ Scissors, then they get hit by Handy Rob. That causes them to wreck. Oh, right there, it was Obi-Wan who helped them back up on their wheels. Wow, that was a big hit by Obi-Wan. Yeah, he spun their car around and flipped it back over. And there you have it, Dom Drift King Jr. Woodley and Handy Rob Frontier will be the last two drivers going to round two of the tournament. I'm really looking forward to seeing the action in round two. You've been watching the 3D Botmaker Diecast Racing Leagues, King, King of, of the, the Mountain. Mountain.